join me as I country up this tray I got at Dollar General. Hey everybody, it's Colette with Blessings Craft Therapy, if you didn't know. And if you did, thanks so much for coming back. All right, so we start by taking some dishwasher safe Mod Podge and covering the bottom of the tray. And let me just tell you, this tray I got at Dollar General, it was on clearance for 90% off. What? I know. Now we're going to dry the tray. Make sure that that Mod Podge is dry. Here we go. Flip it over just to prove it's from Dollar General. Now you can, you could totally measure it to figure out how big you want your fabric. But look at this splatter screen from Dollar, Dollar Tree fits perfect. So all I'm going to do is take that splatter screen and trace it onto my fabric. This fabric I got at Michael's, but I've seen this at Dollar Tree as well, like little fat quarters. I'm not kidding. Anyways, so I traced that splatter screen and all I'm doing is cutting it out. So you see here that tray is dry and I'm going to put my little circle on the bottom. Just make sure I didn't cut it poorly. I did cut it poorly, by the way, but it's okay because we can, we can fix it or hide it really. So there's that. So all I did also was have a piece of parchment paper and I have my little iron that I got at Walmart and I'm going all around making sure to get on the insides as well to iron our fabric onto our tray. And I'm using parchment paper. You may not have to. My concern was that it was going to, you know, some of the Mod Podge was going to uh, melt and get my iron yucky and I didn't want that because then I'd have to clean it and ew. <laughs> Anyways, so I just keep going around making sure that I adhere, like the edges are the parts that I really want to make sure are really down. Um, but again, you know, just go around. This is not rocket science, you know. And also keep in mind, the this is a metal tray. Metal gets hot when you iron it. So put it on a heat safe surface and don't be touching it a whole lot until it cools off. I just don't want you to hurt yourself. But anyway, so that's what we're doing keep doing it. Yay. Um, now I was thinking I could have put Mod Podge over it um, at, to seal it so then it was washable, but I'll get to be honest with you. I, I like this matte look to it. So then I take some jute rope I got at Dollar Tree and I put some glue on the um, along the inside edge and I'm just going to glue this jute all the way around in the inside. And friends, like it's this easy. This easy. That's it. I got a 60 cent tray. <laughs> I probably paid maybe $3 total for the whole thing. But now it fits my decor. I just absolutely love this. Now, also, I just want to warn you, if you're doing this and you're doing the jute, don't pull up on the jute because it can actually release the fabric from the tray, right? If you pull it too hard, it'll pull it up and that's no fun. So, but anyways, look at right? You could you could put a little plate on it and carry it around, or you can use it as a tray on your counter as a pretty decor piece, but I don't care. I am so into this. I love it. Here it is with little decor pieces. Oh, isn't that nice? And oh, you could use it to bring some, oh, look, here's your coffee and a little treat. I don't know. <laughs> Either way, I love it. Anyways, friends, thank you so much for watching, and I hope this inspires you.